The new Toyota Stout is coming to the US sooner than we thought, and it's coming with a lot of insane features. This is really good for us because it has amazing performance and capability, on top of the things we really need in the compact truck market. It's bringing that Toyota reliability and the TRD badge with it, but most of all, an incredible performance. But first, let's talk about the burning question. Will the Stout make its grand entrance in the US as an electric marvel? Well, the possibility is there. However, without concrete specs like range, battery size or power figures, it's a bit of a guessing game. What we know is that the Toyota Stout is coming with its powerhouse TNGAK platform. And lurking beneath the hood lies the formidable 2.5-litre dynamic force engine straight from the RAV4, churning out a jaw-dropping 203 horsepower and 184 pound-feet of torque. And if that's not enough to get your heart racing, brace yourself for the turbocharged thrill of the 2023 Highlander's 2.4-litre turbo i4 engine, pumping out an astonishing 265 horsepower and an eye-popping 310 pound-feet of torque. But hold on to your hats because here's the kicker. Most of us don't really need more than this powerhouse duo. However, there's one thing that reigns supreme in the compact truck arena – fuel efficiency. The Maverick takes the crown with an impressive 42 miles per gallon in the city, 33 miles on the highway and a combined 37. So let me ask you, is it even a wonder that it's hogging the limelight, leaving competitors like the Santa Cruz and other trucks choking on its dust? And this is a big deal, especially when it comes to the Toyota Stout, because the first thing we should consider before talking about what it'll be like is what it'll be up against. The Ford Maverick and Hyundai Santa Cruz have been going head-to-head -head in the ring. Maverick's bringing the heat with its hybrid punch, while Santa Cruz is still pondering its next move, and that has been a bad thing for them, and the scoreboard from 2023 shows that clearly. The Maverick rolls in with a jaw-dropping 94,000 units sold, leaving the Santa Cruz trailing at a modest total of just under 37,000. That's what I call a growth spurt, clocking in at nearly 18% year over year. It's like the whole world's chanting for compact trucks, setting the stage for what could be an epic entry of the Toyota Stout. But as of now, the Maverick's the Alpha, giving the Ranger a run for its money. It's like comparing a compact coupe to a full-size sedan, with the Maverick standing a bit shorter and narrower than the Ranger. That gives it a huge advantage when it comes to efficiency, and that is what they need to worry about. It's common sense, really. If Toyota wants to claim the top spot in the competition, it needs to step up its fuel economy game. Maybe even consider slipping in one of their hybrid powertrains. But as of now, there's no word on Toyota rolling out a hybrid version. But they have solved this challenge in a unique way and with their own method. Let me explain. The Game Plan It's all about understanding the game and the market, you see. Want to rake in those profits? Gotta step up your game. Ford's already on it, hitting the scene with their top-notch fuel economy offerings. So it's only natural that Toyota's keeping a close eye on their moves. And hey, doesn't it just click? Ford nails it with the compact truck tailor-made for city slickers, prioritizing fuel efficiency without breaking the bank. They've set the bar high, no doubt. But don't think for a second that Toyota's sitting on the sidelines. Nah, they're eyeing up their slice of the pie, too. But here is the thing at this point. Going toe-to-toe -to -toe with Ford is not the smartest move, and it's not because they can't handle the competition. No, it's because they leave a crater-sized hole in the market. Look at the top dogs in the compact truck realm, the Maverick and Santa Cruz. They both pack that urban charm, tailor-made for the asphalt warriors out there. So if they come in with the same appeal, then there would be no other company left to fill that gap, so the Stout is coming to a market that has a gap still wide open. Toyota's got a shot at swooping in and filling that void. That is why this compact truck is coming with the TNGA platform, and let me tell you, it's not just your run-of-the-mill tech upgrade, it's flipping the script on the whole game. It's the backbone behind heavy hitters like the RAV4 and Highlander, and its adaptability is downright mind-blowing. This is Toyota's unsung hero, and it's coming swinging with a solid yet nimble build that keeps that center of gravity low for some seriously sweet handling. But here's the kicker. It's the magic sauce fueling Toyota's fan favorites 
outshining the competition is its middle name. Check out the SUVs riding on the same platform, like the Highlander. Towing a whopping 5,000 pounds? That's child's play for the Stout. That is why it's gearing up to knock most flagship trucks out of the park. But the most interesting thing is, this beast of a truck isn't just another run-of-the-mill powerhouse. It's engineered to take you on an off-road journey like no other. So prepare yourself for a ride that's not just tough, but downright ferocious. This isn't your average off-roader. It's a force to be reckoned with, ready to conquer any terrain with style and grit. And if you're after the ultimate adventure, feast your eyes on the TRD Pro package. Toyota's Magnum Opus in off-road customization. Imagine the stout, beefed up with a lifted stance, a souped-up all-wheel drive system, and an engine that purrs like a contented kitten, no matter where you take it. Envision those big, beefy tires hugging the terrain, a suspension that laughs in the face of bumps, and an exterior that turns heads like a supermodel at a party. If you ask me, this could be the knockout punch, the final nail in the coffin for the mavericks out there. But don't take my word for it. Just watch carefully and tell me your own judgment. Price and competition First, let's dive into the nitty-gritty of the numbers, the real deal-breaker in this segment. We're talking about navigating through the competitive landscape without stepping on the toes of the Tacoma, hitting the sweet spot at a solid $29,995. But throw in some electric power and suddenly, we're looking at a potential surge in that price tag, all thanks to those high-priced batteries. It makes you wonder if it's all within reach, doesn't it? Can Toyota pull off an EV truck while walking on that tightrope of balancing costs and innovation? That's precisely why, when it comes to manufacturing, they've got to be strategic to dodge those pesky tariffs. Toyota's got its strategy in place, with plants strategically located across the US, from Kentucky to Indiana, churning out popular models like the Sienna, Highlander, and Grand Highlander. The stage is set, the spotlight's on, and we're gearing up for an epic showdown. Now we can sit and talk about the competition all day. But here's the thing, Toyota doesn't need to worry about that because they've one thing that no one can match, which is just insane because there are a lot of them. Toyota faces competition not only from Ford but also from Chevy and Ram, the other members of the Detroit Big Three. Chevy introduces the compact Montana in Mexico, meanwhile the Ram Rampage is coming. Additionally, Japanese and Korean manufacturers are entering the fray, with Subaru resurrecting the Brat, previously embodied by the Subaru Baja, aimed at a distinct customer base valuing power and functionality. But like I said, they don't need to worry about all these. Because when it comes to the everyday chaos of commuting, Toyota's reputation for crafting rock-solid, unwavering rides is second to none. Honestly, when you think Toyota, you're practically thinking trustworthiness. But Toyota isn't just about reliable rides anymore, they're also setting the bar high for safety and convenience. The Stout, gearing up to hit the roads, packs a punch with its advanced features straight from Toyota's safety arsenal, dubbed the Toyota Safety Sense TSS 3.0. And guess what? They're not holding back. This safety suite is said to be a standard across the board, from brand new models to the upgrading ones. But hey, Let's talk about what really turns heads in the automotive world. Sure, power, reliability, and fuel efficiency matter, but let's face it, catching the eye of potential buyers takes a bit more. Enter the Toyota Stout, ready to steal the show with a fusion of cutting-edge tech and entertainment. Picture this, a whopping 12.3-inch interactive touchscreen display, blending seamlessly with must-have features like Apple CarPlay and Android Auto compatibility making every ride a tech-savvy joyride. Plus, when we're talking off-road prowess, one can't help but think of the image of that iconic TRD badge. It's like peanut butter and jelly, right? So, considering the latest off-road marvel from Ford, the tremor package for the Maverick, it's like the gauntlet has been thrown down. Toyota's got to jump on this wagon, right? What do you think? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.